never would have done it otherwise. The blood of 133 people is on your hands, Elias. You think I don't know that? After the bomb went off, I knew it was just a matter of time before I was found out. I felt horrible. Alex calling you to represent her must have been a dream come true, huh? All that access we gave you, you were in the center of it all. I thought the worst was over until yesterday, when the terrorists called me again and said I had one last task. And then I'd be free forever. I was to bring that trigger to this hotel and wait for instructions. I panicked. I, I mean, I didn't want to be responsible for any more deaths. So why not come to us? We could have helped you. Like the FBI helped you? I, they'd arrest me. A terrorist or not, I'm responsible, and I thought of a better way. Did drugging and framing me, since you knew the bomber modeled his stuff off of my work? And given everything you'd done in your life. Instead of taking responsibility for yourself, you decided my life for yours was a pretty fair trade. The FBI had enough circumstantial evidence. I just had to point them in your direction. So I pretended to sleep in my office, slip my tail. You're despicable. I wanted you to find Simon. I brought you here because I want you to try and stop this bomb. I had three choices. Come clean, carry out the second attack myself, or frame Simon and hope to stop it. Look, the only thing we want to hear from you is where the bomb is. I don't know. The only thing that makes sense is that it's in this building somewhere. They wanted me here, and they wanted me dead. Please just don't let go of that trigger, Simon. Call him now. And then Vice President Biden's going to... Excuse me, ma'am. We are evacuating. We have a credible threat, and we need everyone out right now. How credible? The bombs...